I am a country, small country town girl from the middle of nowhere who is absolutely and utterly addicted to the ocean now. And I really dedicated my whole life to telling the story, lending my voice to the voiceless, to the seabirds who have something to say, something very important to say, and don't have a way to say it. I love seabirds because they are so incredibly dynamic and so incredibly full of personality. They constantly inspire me with their ability to reflect what's going on in the ocean and really be my eyes and my ears and tell me what's going on out there. The seabirds are really telling a worrying message. Uh, their story is really one of increasing amounts of pollutants and plastics in the ocean with projections into the future of, of more of the same if, if we don't do something to act. There's no doubt that a lot of my days are quite tough. I see things that I really wish that I didn't have to see and I have to tell stories that I really wish I didn't have to tell. But each of us have a role in this in this world, and that is my role. I, I have mixed feelings about the future. I feel an immense sense of stress about what we face, the scale and the, and the severity of the challenge that we face. Um, but I think that even sometimes when the war is lost, uh, you don't give up the fight, you don't wave the white flag. We continue to fight and innovate and continue to do the research and monitoring that will hopefully one day show that all of these changes that we've made, new policy, new legislation, new manufacturing methods, will hopefully be able to detect that. The seabirds who will continue to tell their story of being our ocean sentinels will one day come back and tell me that the ocean is no longer filled with as much plastic as it used to be. And then the hope will really be revealed.